What's good everyone, welcome back to a very special episode of GNG News. I haven't opened up any Pokemon booster packs for a little while, so today I'm going to open up a Scarlet and Violet Obsidian Flame Pokemon booster pack, as you can see. I also have a Scarlet and Violet, and a Sword and Shield Silver Tempest. And I have a couple of other booster packs as well to open up that you will see over the next couple of days. Hope everybody is good. Now before we get into this, let's read the little blurb on the back. Raging Flames formed in darkness. Red Hot Ember illuminates the pitch. Black night and sparks flare into the inferno as Charizard EX surges forth with newfound powers of darkness. The glittering terrestrial phenomenon post Pokemon imbues some Pokemon EX like Tyranitar, Eskew, and Vespaqueen with different types than usual, while Dragonite EX and Greedent EX show mastery of their own inner strength. Not to be outdone, Raver Room EX. Melmetal EX and more Pokemon promise to change the course of the battle in the Pokemon Scarlet and Violet Obsidian Flame expansion pack. And in total, it says there are over 190 cards in the Obsidian Flame set, and you need 60 cards in order to make a deck. Don't forget to check out my shorts as well if you want to see what I get from the digital code cards. Green and white code card. Okay, let's start this off. The first card for today is Bonsley, having 30 health points, being a fighting type Pokemon. Dex entry of 438, being a Bonsai Pokemon. Having a move of bubbling, 110. In order to adjust the level of fluids in its body, it, exu it exudes water from its eyes. This makes it appear as if it is crying. Dolliv, 80 health points, graph type Pokemon with a dex entry of 929, being a olive Pokemon with a move of Sunny Wind, 20 out of 197. Dolvin shares its tasty, fresh scented oil with others. This species has coexisted with humans since time long ago. Wow, near enough an ancient, uh, like an ancient Pokemon. So we have Typo. Having 70 health points, being a water type Pokemon with a dex entry of 535, being a tadpole Pokemon with a move of screw tail, 50 out of 197. It uses sound waves to communicate with others of its kind. People and other Pokemon species can't hear its cries of warning. Sir so Skit up next, having 60 health points, being a grass type Pokemon or a leaf type Pokemon with a dex entry of Lunge. I'm joking, with a move of Lunge and a dex entry of 283. Having a move of Lunge, which allows you to flip a coin if Tails this attack does nothing. It's a Pond Skater Pokemon, 6 out of 197. They usually live on ponds, but after an evening shower, they may appear on puddles in towns. Probass. Or Probobass, should I say, 150 health points, steel type Pokemon with a dex entry of 476, being a compass Pokemon with a move of Iron Buster and Triple Nose, 147 out of 197. It uses three small units to catch prey and battle enemies. The main body mostly just gives orders. Vengeful Punch, Pokemon Tool Trainer. If the Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out by damage from an attack from your opponent's Pokemon, put four damage counters on that attacking Pokemon. That's a good card to have. 197 out of 197. So this is the 197th card from this set, which is its last number. Well, not including Secret Rares. Uh, you may attach any number of Pokemon tools to your Pokemon during your turn. You may attach only one Pokemon tool to each Pokemon, and it stays attached. Also as well, don't forget to check out uh, my Pokemon videos because recently I started playing the game just to show you guys I can actually play the game and I've been playing the game for years so you can see if I have any skill at playing the game. Skomori, 120 health points being a steel type Pokemon with a dex entry of 227 being a armor bird Pokemon with a move of slashing steel and peck, 142 out of 197. People fashion swords from Skomori's shed feathers. So this Pokemon is popular is a popular element in the her heraldic design. That's pretty cool. Wigglet, and I was kind of like in two minds about this Pokemon because I know they're making all these like newer versions of original Pokemons, but I don't know. Diglett's one of my favorite Pokemon. I didn't really feel like we needed Wigglet, but it is pretty cool. Uh, 60 health points. 
And that is a water type Pokemon with a dex entry of 960, being a Garden Eel Pokemon with a move of Rain Splash, 58 out of 197. The Pokemon can pick up the scent of a Veluza just over 65 feet away and will hide itself in its sand. Hmm. Then we have Nummel having 90 health points and being a fire type Pokemon with a dex entry of 322 being a Num Pokemon having a move of Hot Magma 31 out of 197. Magma of almost 2,200 degrees Fahrenheit courses through its body. When it grows cold, the magma hardens and it slows itself. Ooh, look at this! There we go! Houndstone EX, 260 health points, having a move of Big Bite and Last Respects, 102 out of 197. This is a beast of a card. Evolution of Grieve Yard. I am very happy with this one. I'm not going to lie. Cool, shiny effect to it as well. Kind of seems like stars. I'm really happy with that. And the final card for today was a basic electric type energy. So yeah, great pack, great pull. Really happy to have this one in my collection. If you've enjoyed watching this video, leave a like on the video, subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you haven't done already, and I'll be back in another one opening up one more of these Pokemon Booster Packs.